Hi, Wellness Warriors. I'm Melissa with Mental Muscle Wellness. And today I want to talk about how to find the right shoe for your foot. I have a blog post up on the blog, which I'll link down below in the description box that goes into a little bit more specific detail um, about the arches of your feet and how they sort of work to disperse forces. What you really need to know is that the dispersion of force is important if you're going to be engaged in exercise or activity because as you move, the forces kind of change. And so you wanna make sure that your feet have the correct support that they need. The easiest way to find the shape of your arches, whether they're high, normal, or neutral, or low, is to actually do a really simple test and you just need a few things at home. First thing that you'll need is water. The second thing that you'll need are your bare feet. And the third thing that you'll need is something dark to step on. Um, if you happen to have a dark colored bath mat or bath towels, those will work. And if you don't, a dark piece of construction paper will do the job just fine. So all you're going to do is you're going to get the bottom of your feet wet um, and they need to be fairly decently wet. You're going to step down firmly on your bath mat, towel, or piece of construction paper. And then you're going to bring your foot straight up and off the paper. Try not to move from side to side as you might smear the imprint of the bottom of your foot. Once you've moved, you can take a look at the shape that's actually made in the imprint. If you have a very narrow channel off to the outside of your foot that connects the heel of your foot to the ball and the toes, that means that you have higher arches. And if you have higher arches, you're going to want to look for shoes that actually meet the bottom of your foot, that possibly provide a little bit of cushioning. And if they don't do that, you're going to want to invest in um, some orthotic inserts for your workout sneakers. If what you see on your imprint is a more complete picture of your foot, if you have a very large section that connects the heel to the ball of your foot and the toes, then you have low arches or flatter feet. If you have flatter feet or low arches, you're going to want to look for a shoe that maybe has the word support in its name. What that means is that the shoe is built to actually come up higher and almost fake your foot into having a higher arch. It will allow your foot to disperse forces more advantageously for you, and it will result in fewer pressure points during exercise and workouts. If your imprint is somewhere in between, if you've got a little bit of channel there, but it's not, it's not very narrow and it's not super wide, then congratulations. You have normal arches and you can wear whatever pair of sneakers feels good to your feet as long as you're not getting hurt after you wear them. I hope you found this video informational. And if so, make sure that you click the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you get notified when I upload. Until next time, be well, friends.